Whether you have the classic Burberry scarf or you have a bit of a fine colorway like me, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can style your beautiful cashmere Burberry scarf. Burberry scarf is such a beautiful luxury quality investment for your wardrobe. So of course you want to know how to style it in many different ways so you can get the most out of your beautiful purchase. Now as you can see I don't actually own the classic colorway of the Burberry scarf. I went for this pink colorway. I think it's called Ice Pink Check and I decided to go for this particular colorway because I actually own a lot of pink in my wardrobe and lots of different colors that go with pink and that's the fun thing is these scarves come in lots lots of different colorways so you can really choose one that suits your personality but then of course there is the classic Burberry colors and as soon as you see that it's so recognizable you know that it's a Burberry scarf so just before we get into actually styling the scarf I just want to quickly talk about colors and the tones of your outfits when styling a Burberry scarf I just think it is easiest and best to stick to neutrals for the rest of your outfit because the scarf really is the standout piece so if you get a little bit too busy with your outfit it can really take away from your scarf you know you don't want something like stripes or dots going on because it is going to clash and then with colors for the outfits I find it neutral tones to be great to go with a scarf and when I'm talking about neutral tones I mean black navy white cream tan and of course camel color that is going to come in here because that is that classic Burberry color that you will find in most of these scarves anyway and then from there what you can also do is pick a color out of the particular scarf that you have and tie it in with your outfit. So that's what you can do if you do want to pop a color. Like the classic Burberry, it has a red in it. So you could totally do a red sweater, maybe a red handbag, even just a little touch of red lipstick. That would be super cute. That's a way to add that little pop of color so that it's not all neutral, but you're sort of tying it in with the scarf so it doesn't get too much. And then for me, obviously, I've got a lot of pink in here, so I could totally do some pink in the outfit. Okay. Okay, so now that we've talked about colors, let's get into styling some outfits with our scarf. Okay, the first way to style your Burberry scarf is with a trench coat. And Burberry actually invented the trench coat. They actually made it for the British Army back in World War One, So the trench coat is there. So of course it's gonna go well with the Burberry scarf. Now, I actually don't own a Burberry trench coat, nor is it something that I'm actually looking into buying at least right now, maybe for a future investment, but I am pretty happy with the one that I own. This is from Jack Wills and it does the job just fine. I find the Jack Wills one to have the flair of Burberry, obviously not with the price tag, but for its price point, it is really good quality and it is nice and warm and and pretty waterproof and of course a ton of companies do trench coats not just Burberry not just Jack Wills so they're pretty easy to find and I find that they're just a really great pairing with the Burberry scarf I also find that if I am styling a trench coat and I'm intending it to be open for the day that I do like to have the scarf just at length just once around the neck and sort of hanging because the length of the scarf with the coat it actually falls quite nicely but if I am planning to tie the coat up then I will actually do a tie on the scarf like so and have it sit up here and that way when I actually close the trench coat it can pop up the top there which brings me to the next way that I like to style the Burberry scarf and that is having it popping out of a jacket or a vest this is my favorite little pink puffy vest and I just like to have it just popping out the top here so what I do under the jacket or the vest is oh, Excuse me. is I literally just tie it in a big loop at the top and then I'll bring it up to my neck and the tassels might be a bit longer than what you're wearing so I do sort of like bunch it up this way not so much you kind of want to make it flat so you're not like adding extra weight and then just zip up and then once you have it zipped up you can kind of mess around with the top puff it out a little bit so it's just peeking out there and there you go and because the Burberry scarf it's cashmere so it's so soft and it just feels like your neck is just getting a warm blanket around it all day long the next Way to style your Burberry scarf is with a really cute girly outfit so maybe a little sweater dress or a cute skirt and blouse combination so there's multiple ways that you can do the scarf with an outfit like this there is obviously just 
the straight up and down one. I kind of like to do one down and then an over the shoulder. Good day to you, sir. So that is super cute and it definitely shows off the outfit, but the scarf is still there. Then you can also do multiple ways of like tying it around your neck and having it up. So you can start with the center of the scarf at the front of your neck and then pull it around like so. And with all of these, you just have to mess around with them a bit until it looks how you want it to look. With this one, I especially love to do this when I have a little collar like this Peter Pan collar and that kind of shows up the top. And then if you want to, you can also actually make a tiny knot at the bottom of your scarf and tuck it underneath. So it sort of gives the look of an infinity scarf and then it can just sort of all sit up the top there. Now, if you do like the look of the scarf hanging down like so, I really like this look, but it can get a bit annoying because if you're wearing a coat over the top, like the trench coat and you have it down, the coat actually sort of acts as like keeping it to go down. Whereas if you don't have that coat, it can kind of get annoying, like swinging around and that kind of thing, which I don't know, that annoys me. So a really good trick for this is actually to get a belt. So if you get a little neutral belt and puff the belt around with the scarf actually sitting underneath the belt. So that is a really cute option to not have your scarf swinging around and especially if you own a statement belt, maybe you have a Gucci belt or something, that could look really cute and that way you're showing off the belt. Now, if you do want to add a coat over the top, you can still sort of get this effect if you want to. So if you have something like a wool coat, you can totally do the same thing and have the scarf sitting on top rather than having it open and going down underneath. I've just got a pink coat on. I know I own a lot of pink, I told you. So I actually probably in real life wouldn't do pink on pink. I would probably change into a little white button down, but for the purposes, of showing you how cute this looks and you can cinch it like so so the scarf is on display so obviously the Burberry scarf looks really beautiful with dressed up outfits but if you're gonna buy a Burberry scarf you may as well get as much use out of it as possible so you can totally dress it casually too you could either wear it with a pair of jeans maybe an oversized sweater or even dress it down to the point of being really casual like wear some workout leggings I've got a sweatshirt on obviously I've gone for the darker neutrals for this outfit but what a cute outfit for like bopping down to the gym or coming back from the gym or just a lazy day shopping that sort of thing so although the Burberry scarf obviously it looks gorgeous dressed up you may as well dress it down too so there you go I hope that gave you some inspiration to style your Burberry scarf I hope you found this video helpful if you did please return the love and give it a big thumbs up and if you would like to see a more in-depth review of the scarf my thoughts feelings let me know in the comments down below and I'll totally make that video for you guys and while you're here I make lots of fun fashion and lifestyle content so if you like videos like this make sure to hit that subscribe button and also hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time bye bye